Hey guys, Gizmodict here and today I'm going to show you how to unlock the bootloader of your Xiaomi Redmi Note 4 and install a custom recovery on it. This video is actually a continuation of my last video in which I showed you guys how to install the developer ROM on the Redmi Note 4. Due to some new restriction from Xiaomi, you can only unlock the bootloader if you are on the developer ROM so watch the previous video first, install the developer ROM and then follow this tutorial. So to unlock the bootloader of your phone, you first need to have the permission from Xiaomi and to get that, you need to go to en.miui.com slash unlock. Enter your account details here and then you will be presented with a form which you need to fill. Enter your information and then there's a box where you need to write the reason as to why you want to unlock the bootloader of your phone. Write something similar to what you can see on the screen right now and then click on submit. Normally the request should be accepted within 2-3 to three days, so you have to be very patient. In the meantime, download the Mi Flash Unlock tool which we will use to unlock the bootloader of the phone. Okay, so considering that your request has been accepted and you do have a developer ROM on your phone, first of all make a complete backup so that you don't lose your important data. Now head over to the link given in the video's description and download the TWRP image file, the SuperSU zip file and the no verity zip file. Copy the SuperSU zip file and the no verity zip file to your phone. Now on your Redmi Note 4, power off the device and then enter the fast boot mode. To enter fast boot, press the volume down and the power button together. On your PC, open Mi Flash tool, log in with your details and then it will give you a pop up saying that you need to connect to your phone. Connect your phone to your PC in fast boot mode and let the software do its work. Once the unlocking process is done, reboot your phone. This boot might take some time but once that is done, you can check if the phone has been unlocked or not. To do that, go to about phone and then tap on the MIUI version a couple of times to unlock developer option. Now go to the developer options and as you can see, it shows that our bootloader has been unlocked. Now to install the recovery onto the phone, you will need ADB and fastboot drivers on your PC. I will not be showing you how to get these drivers but I will put a link in the video's description. It's quite easy to get them. Copy the TWRP image file which we downloaded earlier into your ADB folder. Now once again, connect your Redmi Note 4 in fastboot mode to your PC. Navigate to the ADB folder, press shift and right click and select the open command window here option. Now type fastboot flash recovery followed by your image file name. Press enter and then the TWRP will be installed onto your phone. Once that is done, you first need to boot your phone into the recovery mode before starting it. So to do that, press the volume up and the power button together to enter TWRP. Once inside TWRP, install the no verity zip file and the super SU zip file. Let the phone do its work and once that is done, reboot your phone. Once your phone reboots, you should have an unlocked, rooted Redmi Note 4 with a custom recovery. Go and download PHH Super SU from Google Play Store to complete the process. So there you have it. You can now flash custom ROMs and some other cool things onto your Redmi Note 4. If you do have any questions about this process, then do let me know in the comments. If my video helped you out, then definitely like and share it. You can also follow me on my social media pages for more updates. Do subscribe to my channel by clicking the red subscribe button below the video for more Redmi Note 4 content which is coming soon. Thanks for watching and I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.